You've probably seen all over social media lots of people saying 2016 has been the worst year ever. But it can't all be bad news, right? Well, I stepped out to Burlington's Church Street to talk to both Vermonters and visitors. And the results may surprise you. So 2016 was great. Even on a chilly night in Burlington, most people could name at least one highlight from 2016. I'm from India and I'm visiting my sister. So this holiday has been one of the best things that's happened. For some, it was seeing loved ones. My cousins came over that they usually don't come over because they live on another, they live somewhere else far away from here. And my brother and his wife have come to visit us and we're very happy and uh, enjoying ourselves. For others, it was academic achievements. We all graduated from college and we all got jobs. I got my master's degree in science and mechanical engineering. It felt fantastic after two and a half years of extra school on top of um, undergraduate school. And some just got really lucky this year. We got a trip to go to Disney for Christmas. How excited were you? We're really excited. excited. We're going to Disney! <laughs> But many also realized it wasn't all happiness for everyone and had advice for those down on their luck in 2016. I think hope is all we have and we got to stick on to it. Whether 2016 brought you good times or bad, if you plan to round out the year here at Church Street at First Night Burlington, there are some things you should know. Buttons are still available to buy day of. They get you into dozens of festival events for free from 11 a.m. to midnight. Marketplace officials expect between 11 and 15,000 visitors Saturday. So if you plan in to ring in the new year here, expect to do it with some crowds. In Burlington, Abby Isaacs, NBC5 News.